In this video, I'm going to teach you how to create a coastal timer just like this one I've got here. So let's go ahead and start from the very beginning. We're going to go into a folder and we're going to create, we're going to right click onto our background and press user interface widget blueprint has user widget. We're going to call this one timer tutorial one just for the, for this video. So come into the left side of the screen drag on a canvas panel drag on an image you're going to be using this for your background Click in the top right up here you can't see my face is in the way up here set anchors to point basically just click on this top button click anchors and then this one where it's in the middle of the timer so let's go ahead and sync that to the middle for me, that looks good. So then that is, yeah, for me, that's good enough. So then inside of this, we're going to have to drag in a text block from the left side of the screen, choose what kind of text we want on this. So I'm going to choose black text. And I'm just going to leave that at that. Actually, inside of this, we're going to change the text to zero, 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 okay. Have the anchors you click for everything you're gonna put onto the screen. So then we're actually gonna add an image as well, a second image. And we're just gonna type in texture and we can add whatever kind of texture we want. If we have an icon, it's like texture icon. For whatever reason, I want this electric thing change this to black so I can see it and remember change the anchors to the one we've got on the same as the other ones so this would be how our timer would look like it would not be at the top of the screen it would be where the normal timer appears at what we need to do next is come into view bindings in the bottom left click add view model now we're going to click device timer view model from here we're just going to press display text oh we don't actually need to do that now. close that press bindings click on our text that we've created for the timer press view bindings add widget text block we're going to click on this little text looking thing and press text then we're going to Click on this one, press creative time of view model, and we're going to press current time. Now, this will just show it how it is like this. I'll show you a quick little example of how it looks like. So, that's how it looks like. The thing is, though, you to actually show this up on your UI, here's what you need to do go inside your timer and look for custom user widget class and change this to whichever whatever you just named it for us we called it the timer tutorial one i have a course for absolute beginners first link in the description if you don't want that and you want to help me out still you can subscribe and use creator code gizmo in the fortnite item shop